You want to click on that and then you see this entire list and what you want to do is you want to pick your game in the list. So as you guys can see, boom, it is Minecraft. So we're going to click on OK. But as you guys can see, we have a, like a black bar and let's say, Alex, let's drag it down. It doesn't help and then we get the black bar at the top. Okay guys, quickly before this video starts, I want to mention that I'm not going to do any more face cams in OBS since it is a more like for me like I'm doing face cams in deep web in Sony Vegas even in audacity in vlogs and evolving into a better youtuber I decided like I'm not going to make any I'm not going to use any more face cams in OBS I think that's like a personal thing and I think for me it looks kind of like better the quality goes up a little bit if I don't have a face cam because then it's just going to be like like audio so that's what I'm going to do guys so enjoy this little video make sure to smash the like button down below already I'm not going to use any more face cams so in this video I'm going to show you guys how to remove black bars from your gameplay or your windows in general so I would say let's go okay guys so as you guys as you can see we are in OBS Studio as always and first of all I'm going to show you guys what is going to happen if you're just going to capture I would say Minecraft for example with game capture I would say so what the first thing that I'm going to do is I'm gonna go over to the sources uh, tab as you guys can see at the bottom left because here is where you're gonna see all your sources so what we're going to do is we're gonna boot up Minecraft first guys I want to mention that always boot up Minecraft first yeah um, whoops and <laughs> basically guys <laughs> <laughs> what I'm going to do now, that's a hack, I know, fuck it. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to click on add and I'm going to click on uh, game capture, boom. Now I'm going to, I'm just going to call this the game. And as you guys can see, you can, like the window is not clickable. So you just want to uncheck capture any full screen application. Then it becomes clickable. You want to click on that and then you see this entire list. And what you want to do is you want to pick your game in the list. So as you guys can see, boom, it is Minecraft. So we're going to click on OK. But as you guys can see, we have a, like a black bar. And let's say, Alex, let's drag it down. It doesn't help and then we get the black bar at the top so what we're going to do is we're going to stretch this a little bit and we're not gonna we're not gonna uh do it like this and drag it because as you guys can see then the icons aren't fully on the screen anymore but what you want to do is you want to hold shift and the bar luckily is that thin that you won't see the stretch uh screen so what we're going to do is we're going to hold shift and as you guys can see this is the difference so we're not going to be able to tell that and if you want to release shift and you want to click away as you guys can see this game is full screen so that is basically how to get rid of a of black bars guys i mean i can show you like different more diff like more different games like gta 5 or uh, black ops or rocket league or any game that probably will have black bars but it all works the same guys you know, i don't want to bore you guys so it's going to be all the same uh, which is going to be the black bar so you just want to drag it in the corner drag it as you guys can see it stops right there and if you place it down it's not going to work either so basically just put it to the top hold shift drag it you can actually like play it like place it wherever you want but you can just drag it until the entire screen is filled with the game and i would say that's it for this video it's that simple and now you can go ahead and remove all the black bars it, it works the same for um, let's say if your face cam is like that way, it works for video capture device, it works for window capture, it works for whatever the hell capture, you can do it on anything. So that's it for this video, really short I know, but this is how you move like bars. So that's it for this video guys, I really want to thank you guys for watching, thank you for the continued support, and I hope to see you guys tomorrow for an awesome Sony Vegas tutorial, as always on Wednesday. So thank you for watching, make sure to smash the like button down below for more videos, also the subscribe button down below. We're going towards 43 and a half thousand subscribers, it's crazy guys, I cannot thank you guys enough for that, so thank you for watching. I hope this video was helpful to you. If not, make sure to leave your comment down below and I'll be happy to help you out. So, thanks again for watching and I will see you guys tomorrow. Just Alex Halford. <laughs>